Is it too late to consider beefing up your immune system to decrease your chances of contracting the deadly coronavirus disease 2019? President of the St. Lucia Medical and Dental Association, Dr. Mill Clark, says firstly, a healthy, balanced diet is paramount. Ensure that you're getting enough vitamin D, and that doesn't mean that you go out um, all the time or go out into crowds to get your vitamin D. But vitamin D, there's a role for vitamin C. Not the fact that everybody has rushed out to get it. The vitamin C that you get from your diet is enough. There's no need to be taking a whole gram of vitamin C, as most people seem to think. That there's no definitive study that says that it will prevent um, respiratory infections or curtail them. Next, Dr. Clark says getting enough rest and taking care of your mental health may also take a load off your immune system. A break from social media. As some people say, distance yourself sometimes from social media and some of the fake news there. It is important that you not allow yourself, you don't allow yourself, sorry, to become panicked and paranoid. So those things really are very important. It is really an overall strategy to prevent yourself from being ill. We are psychological, biosocial, psychological beings. So one thing affects the other thing, but essentially get enough sleep, rest, mental health, take care of that. So do some yoga, meditate, pray, whatever it is that just puts you at ease and puts your mind at ease is important during this time. The president of the St. Lucia Medical and Dental Association believes that while keeping your immune system up to par is a long-term strategy, individuals must practice social distancing. We need to prevent our immune system from being overwhelmed by a virus which is new, that our bodies are completely naive to, that our population is naive to. Um, So your immune system won't be as efficient fighting that off as other viruses or other bacteria, perhaps, that have been around for a while. So that is the first thing. So we must adhere to the hygiene practices, proper hand washing, cough etiquette, stay away from people who are sick. If you are sick, don't go out and uh, so other people become ill. Dr. Clark also stresses the benefits of engaging in physical activity. She also advises people with chronic illness to ensure that they take the prescribed medications to avoid elevated blood sugar and pressure levels which are not good for the immune health. There is currently no evidence of any supplements, diets or lifestyle changes which can prevent COVID-19. However, research suggests that some supplements with immune-enhancing potential include vitamins C and D, zinc and elderberry. Gina Filippi, HTS News Force.